Hello, my lovelies. Welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly readings. This is going to be for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Before we get into your reading, Taurus, I want to wish every single one of you guys happy holidays. I hope that uh, this new year to come brings the best for all of you guys. Let's get into your reading. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for this month of December 2021. Spirit guides, ancestors, and archangels, please guide our Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What is it that they need to know at this present time? What can they expect for this month of December 2021? Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please allow us to see clearly and concisely what are the messages for Taurus for this month of December. All right, one more shuffle, Taurus. And we're in it to win it. <laughs> All right, we're starting off here with the Six of Cups. Taurus, a lot of reflection. I see you guys internalizing. Um, the holidays is always, you know, that time of the year where we may get a little bit overwhelmed with emotions. Um, this could be you reflecting on the past. This can also be you reflecting on the past, seeing how far you've come and being excited about what is to unfold for you. For others of you, a person from the past may be coming or peeking through. Our, our next card here is the sun card. Wow, beautiful energy. The sun is that of illumination. It is that of blessings that are being bestowed upon you, whether you're aware of them or not. Uh, this can also represent a reunification of some sort. For some of you guys, you may be hearing from someone from the past that perhaps you fell off or haven't had any communication or contact. For others of you, this can also represent the solidifying of some type of connection or relationship. For those of you guys that are in a relationship, this could be the going or taking it to the next level. Um, and it comes to you very unexpected. Uh, for others of you, those of you guys that are single, this can also represent letting go of the past and knowing and understanding the power that you have now in the present, looking towards the future. This can also represent a relationship coming to you, Taurus. Beautiful energy. Okay, let's get into your reading. Now, your first card here is the Magi. Wow. So I see a lot of manifestations for you, Taurus. Obviously, the planet alignments right now are definitely assisting you guys. We just went to through a lunar eclipse. We're going to be going through another solar eclipse on December the 9th. Sorry, December the 4th, um, which is the combination of a previous uh, eclipse that we experienced in the sign of Sagittarius. So for a lot of you guys, this is the full blast manifestation of uh, bringing in a soul type of connection. The magician is always an indication of having and knowing the power that you possess by having all the tools within you. Anything that it is that you've been wanting, you've been craving, you've been desiring, whether it's love, whether it's success, whether it's abundance, health, prosperity, in any single aspect of your life, Taurus, what they're telling you here is that everything that you want and you crave, you have within yourself. Therefore, there's no reason to doubt or to fear, will I ever have a long-term committed relationship? Will I ever have the financial stability? Will I ever attain success? Because if this is something that you crave, it is internalized and it is within you. If you didn't want these things or if these things weren't meant for you, you wouldn't know or have the consciousness to want them. So the magician is all about that. It is about the understanding, the power that you have, that you possess to bring into your life whatever it is that you're wanting or that you're working towards. With the Six of Cups, the Sun, and the Magician, for some of you guys, this is a soulmate type of connection that is coming in for you. Now, this is in the month of December. Keep in mind, for some of you Taurus, depending on your alignments, on your planets, on your houses, it all comes in very different um, timing. So you must understand that uh, timing is fluid in the tarot card, especially when we're doing general readings. But what they're telling you here is don't doubt this process. Everything you have been through in the past, Taurus, there is a purpose and a reason for it. Now, your next card here is Sovereign of Coins. 
This is the Queen of Pentacles. This is your earthly energy, Taurus. This is you being empowered. This is being more confident. This is knowing, again, the power that you possess to be able to manifest whatever it is that you want. Now is the time to think and dream big, Taurus. Your next card here is Judgment. That whatever decisions and whatever actions you take from now moving forward all through the month of December is going to be a direct connection to the manifestations that start to unfold. So it is crucial and important at this point in time. If you're trying to draw in love, vibrate that of love. Give love even to those that are strangers. If you go to the store and you see a homeless person asking for money or asking for food, Take the time to acknowledge them. Even if you don't have any money or anything to offer them, offer them a conversation. Give love in order to be able to receive love because when you start to vibrate to that energy, it will happen so quickly that your head's going to be spinning. <laughs> now, if we're talking about career or finances and you're wanting to, you know, manifest stability, Start to really internalize what it is exactly that. What is it that you consider success? And work towards that to be able to achieve it. Your next card here is the Seven of Cups. A lot of opportunities, you guys. A lot of opportunities that are unfolding for you. Three of Coins. I see you guys, for some of you, if you've been working really hard at a company. And it almost feels like you've gone unnoticed. That's not going to be the case anymore. December all the way to January, there's a lot of manifestations for you guys. Opportunities coming your way. Some will literally fall on your lap, while others, you'll hear about them. People in your workplace or in your working or your business are going to be speaking about opportunities or positions that are going to be opening up. Like I said, remember initially in the beginning of this reading, the bigger the better. So start focusing and start going and achieving and putting your hand out to the universe to be able to draw in exactly what it is that you want. The three of coins is that of working in a um, in an environment where people are going to be encouraging or your energy is going to be extremely welcome. So again, now is the time to manifest to your true potential, Taurus. And finally, we have here the conqueror of cups. So we have the knight of cups here. So there is definitely love surrounding you, Taurus. For some of you guys, you may actually be on the path or on the journey towards meeting your soulmate. For others of you, uh, you are being aligned with the planets. Like I said, the planets currently assisting you to be able to break through any barriers that you've experienced in the past when we're talking about especially finances. Um, this is opportunities of elevation. This is opportunities of growth. This is opportunities of solidifying what you consider success. And it is about not having, like not letting fear take over you, Taurus. Reach for the stars right now because you're going to be surprised. For others of you, they're also telling me very strongly, um, get out of your comfort zone. Stop being so scared. Stop like stop stopping yourself from growth out of fear of failure you have to reach for the stars that's the only way you're going to be able to land in one of them if you can land on the moon do you see what i'm saying it's about the sky is the limit for you guys for this month of december beautiful beautiful energy taurus i want to wish you guys all the very best happy holidays to yours and to you of course and we will see each other soon till then bye